Hey guys, Liam from Killer Inc here, and today I'm going to be showing you the second generation Critical CX-1 power supply. The CX-1 G2 is a small power unit that is jam-packed with features and loved by many tattoo artists across the globe. So let's take a closer look. As you can see, the robust Critical CX-1 features a display at the top, 5 operating buttons in the middle, and an input for a power cable at the base, along with a standard quarter inch clip cord and foot pedal connections either side. Compared to the first generation model, Critical made some significant quality of life improvements for the second gen CX-1 power supply. This version of the CX-1 is not as bulky as its predecessor and offers a bigger and brighter LCD display for easier use and reading. It also offers a fully digital microprocessor control for increased adaptability. Critical also included a pedal override feature with the second generation CX-1, which allows the user to run their tattoo machine without a foot switch. If you are using a foot switch, such as the Critical wired foot pedal we have here, the manufacturer added the ability to use a maintained pedal mode to go along with the pre-existing momentary mode. You can toggle between the two modes with a simple press of a button, like so. For those using hard start on rotaries, the CX-1 is jump start enabled to provide that extra boost of power when starting your machine. To enable jump start, press and hold the up and down arrows until EN is displayed. Simply repeat the process to disable the feature, with the display showing DIS. The Critical CX-1 offers a peak inrush current of 6 amps with a 3 amp true RMS continuous current. The higher ampacity and built-in short circuit protection offered by the second generation CX-1 allow you to run any rotary or coil machine without power fluctuations. In addition, this power supply has a precision regulated set point voltage of between 1.5 and 17 volts DC and can be adjusted in 0.1 volt steps. Thanks to its small size, the CX-1 can be covered with your typical machine or bottle bags and the lack of protruding buttons make it easy to wipe down if needed. As well as receiving a two year full manufacturer warranty when ordering the critical CX-1, you'll also get a second generation magnetic mount a wing nut screw, cable, and a 45 watt grounded power adapter, which replaces the non-grounded 36 watt version that comes with the previous model. We also offer additional and replacement mounting options on our site. The Critical CX Universal Mount can be used with the CX-1 to mount the power supply on any magnetic surface. If you wish to use the mount on non-magnetic surfaces, we offer Paxa 3 Critical CX suction cups to replace the magnets. You can also go for the Critical CX Steel base plate, which is another great option when you're working off a non-magnetic surface and need a freestanding unit. Attach your CX-1 to the mount and then place it on the base plate with the magnets. The combination of a heavy weight and rubber base means that the base plate will definitely stay put while you're working. Made in the USA, the Critical CX-1 power supply is available to order from Killer Inc via the link in the description below. So now that you've seen it, what do you think? Will the Critical CX-1 be your next power supply? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel.